Now to a deadly crash in the East Bay. An ambulance wound up on its side with a patient inside. Nightbeat's Andrea Nakano is in San Lorenzo with how emergency workers tried to save the woman's life even after they'd been hurt. It took crews about seven hours to clear the accident, and as you can see, the intersection is back open tonight. The Alameda County Coroner's Office has identified the woman who passed away as Catherine Sunday. She was 74 years old. This ambulance was on an emergency call when it became part of the emergency. Different environment for us. We're not usually part of an incident. We're usually responding to an incident. The crash happened just after 11 in the morning at Hesperian and Llewellyn Boulevards. CHP officers say the white Audi collided with the ambulance, tipping it on its side. A firefighter helping the patient, Catherine Sunday, managed to get out of the ambulance and went right to work. That's what our firefighters are trained to do. That's what they do every single day to serve the public. Sean Burroughs, the president of the Alameda County Firefighters Union, says it's typical for a firefighter to ride along in the ambulance when the patient is in critical condition. Although he was injured himself, he quickly attended to the four other people involved in the crash. Was able to provide emergency medical care to the patients on scene and uh, assisted with coordinating incoming resources. The accident is still under investigation. CHP officers say they don't know if the ambulance had its lights and sirens on or if the Audi ran a red light. We're currently talking to several witnesses, uh, working with the county on the cameras that are maybe in this area, as well as local businesses who might have had security cameras, which captured the collision. I talked with a friend of Catherine Sunday tonight. She did not want to be on camera, but she tells me that Catherine was terminally ill with lung cancer. The firefighter, two paramedics, and the driver of the Audi were all taken to a local hospital for their injuries. Andrea Nakano on the Night Beat.